cleaning them, uh, you know, everybody has a technique. You take all the slime off the eel, and you do that in different ways. Usually people just lay them in wood ashes. The newspaper is an ideal thing to use. And you take newspaper and you just squeeze the eel and you wipe it all off and they're just nice and clean and no slime on them. They used to gut them and they used to hang them dry for a couple days and they put them in the oven. Those are called huasas. Huasau is not called a huasau until you clean it, gut it, you hang it overnight to dry. This one was cut in October, so still a little bit frozen. And then you take it and you cut it flat. And then it's a fossil. You fillet it, but you can leave the skin on. I have a couple of recipes that I that I use, and one is the baked eel. I love the baked eel. Cut them into like two inch pieces, slice them down the back. Cut it into nice chunks. Put it on a cookie sheet. All I do is put salt on it, and that's it. And this will be cooking for around 45 minutes. Oh. Look good, huh? Depends on the size of your catch as well, right? If they're small, they're, they're not much meat on them, so you stew them. So once you skin them, the little hairs remain on the, the fish, and you have to cut those off with the scissors. And then you chunk them up. I've been doing this since I was eight years old, so it's been quite a while. But I've been cooking only for maybe 10 years, that's it. You put them in a pot with some onions, some potatoes, water, a little bit of flour, and you boil them. And you make small dumplings. Little dumplings, like little ones, like uh, like a one-inch dumpling. Add some flour now. It smells good now. You can make the stew, and then you make bread, new skin again that we make. And you, after you've made the stew, you put it into a pan. And then you make your new skin again, and then you roll it out and you put it on top, and you put that all in the oven. So you're baking bread, and that stew is being soaked up on the bottom of that bread, and it makes a really good dish. That's probably one of my favorites. It's really good. Um, I like the fact that it's crispy and soft in the middle. And I think the bacon brings out a little bit of a sweet taste in the eel as well. It's very good. It was it's smoked at all? It has a, a taste almost like it It was smoked. The baking probably just makes the oils more active or something as it gets cooked. Excellent. It's delicious.